viewing and uploading videos, and then the recirculation of videos, whether it's a producer just uploaded a song, and then another artist wanted to make a music video for that song, and then maybe fan art evolves from those music videos. だから、そういうホビーの部分で、あの、評価をもらえたっていうのが、で、言ってもまあ一般人。一般人なのに、I am not musician, but それから、すごくびっくりしてるし。And um, and then, of course, like karaoke is a very important part of how it's been circulating recently. That, I guess, translates back online. So you have things like uh, videos being re-uploaded with lyrics or uh, Utate Mita. There's a Utate Mita, and they'll sing a cover of it, like they'll just sing the song, and they record themselves, and they'll upload it on, you know, YouTube or Niko Niko Doga. Niko Niko Doga is a genre of Mita. And then there's people who draw um, PVs, uh, promotional videos for the songs, and there's people who do it. And so, Shitemita, which is uh, play, uh, perform the songs in musical instruments or do rearrangements. But it's like very interesting, like flux and flow and intermeshing of all practices and it really just comes down to individuals doing things together and then it propagates out into this really interesting phenomena. まあ、みんな言ってるんですけど、まあ、アイコンですよね。アイコンであったり、そのハブですね。だから、まあ、シンボルですね。アイドルというシンボルもありますけども、いろんな、えっと、if we were to say Hatsune Miku is participatory culture, maybe it's a zeitgeist, maybe it's just the way people think. I think this world works because you can participate, and it gives you a sense of meaningful participation that it offers. Uh, real dramatic uses of this new technology.